Hello everyone, Mel here with Abstract Fitness. Today I want to focus on different exercise, a full body workout using towels. So you're going to need a longer one and you can use as well dish cloths or face cloths, you decide. Grab your mat, let's get started. Okay, I'm going to use only one and I'm going to start with legs, full body workout. Okay, let's go. So you're going to lunge back. So shoulders are done in back. I'm going to start with my right leg, lift the heart. And you're gonna go as deep as you want and then push back. So bring your eyes into your spine. Let's go down and up. Ready? Let's go. Exhale, inhale. Let's go. Six, five, four, three. So make sure you're looking straight ahead. We're gonna go for one more and then we're gonna switch the legs. There we go. Are you ready? Switch it up. Same thing. Abs are tight. You go as deep as you want. Respect your joints. Good. Again for six, five, four, and three. Two more. And last one. Good. Now I'm going to do a side lunge. So again, nice and tall. And I'm going to start with my right, your left. So I'm going to go out and come back. Okay, let's go. Shoulders down and back. As are tight, you go as deep as you want. Again, respect your joints. Good. Try to keep this knee in line with your ankle. And it's harder for me because I like looking at what I'm doing in the mirror and now I don't have that. So I'm just going to try to, to go with my feelings. Okay, three more. That's it. In two. I'm warm already. Last one. That's it. We're going to switch the legs. Same thing. Nice and tall. Abs tight. Let's go. So press your big toes as well right here on the floor. It's going to help for stability. Four. Three. And two. Okay, for the next exercise, you're going to use the hand towel, the longer one. I'm just going to take it like that, both hands. And I'm going to do a row. I'm going to give you two options. Bent over, abs are tight, shoulders down and back, and squeeze the shoulder blades together without lifting the shoulders. Inhale, exhale. Option one is here. Option two, right here. Option three, lift the leg and keep your hips parallel to each other. I'm going to lift the leg. So choose your option. Ready for eight? Let's go. Inhale. Exhale. So make sure you're keeping the shoulders in the pockets the entire time. Three, two, that's it. Because I'm using one leg, I'm going to switch. If you're choosing both legs, just keep going. Abs are tight. Six, five, four. So try to feel that you're nice and tall from your hip all the way to your head. Two more. And last one. That's it. And release. Okay, now I'm going to do a squat. I'm going to turn here, and then I'm going to face you again. So I'm going to do a squat. While I'm going down, I'm going to bring my arms as high as I can, and then come back up and contract your glutes. Okay? Ready? Let's go. Inhale down, press your big toes on the earth, exhale up, contract your glutes. Let's go, down and up. You decide how deep you can go. Beautiful. Four, three, I know I'm tight in my shoulders. That's why I have a hard time bringing my arms higher. Make sure you're keeping the shoulders down, check them. I'm gonna go for one more. Whew. There we go. I'm warm. I'm going to go back with one 
face cloth. I'm gonna go in semi squat and I'm gonna lunge back and then side. Okay. So semi squat, sit down, lunge back and then side. Lunge back and side. Ready? We're gonna sit down. Shoulders are down and back. Let's go. Squat first, open your legs and then go. Back and side. Back and side. Are you breathing? Woo. I feel my hips as well. There we go, three more. Do you feel the burn? Two. Oh, I love it. <laughs> Last one. Good, and release. How many legs do we have? I'm glad we have only two and not four. We're gonna sit again in a squat. Shoulders down, abs are tight. When you're ready, start back. And then to the side. Again, back, contract your glutes. Side, out of thigh. You still work this one as well. Out of thigh, abduction, because you're standing on one leg, so your entire weight is here. Feel the burn, good. Whew. Two more. One more. Oh, I feel that. <laughs> good, and slowly release, and march. I'm gonna sit on my mat. I'm gonna use the hand towel, the long one, so the white. I'm gonna sit. I'm gonna paddle with it. So I want we do a V sit. I'm gonna give you options again. I want you to lean back, abs are tight, shoulders, and you're gonna go and paddle. If you want to make it harder, lift your feet. Choose your option, let's get started. Inhale, exhale, anytime you have back pain, your abs cannot engage anymore. I prefer you release, take a break, try again. If not, skip this exercise. Six, five, four, three, two, that's it. One more, Whew. and slowly release. I'm gonna do a half roll up. My knees are bent. Same thing, I'm gonna go like that. I'm gonna push my lower back towards the mat and I'm gonna bring my elbow towards the mat and then come back. And I'm gonna do the same thing the other side. So that's a Pilates exercise. Shoulders are down and back, abs are tight. Pelvic floor up if you can. We're gonna inhale, exhale, push your lower back first, look down at your stomach, bring your elbow towards the floor, inhale, exhale, the other side. That's it. And again, listen to your lower back. No pain. Just have fun with it. I love this one. I do it often in my Pilates. This is not a beginner exercise, it's more advanced. Can we go again for four? Three. Two. One more. Nice, and slowly release. Let's turn around. I'm gonna do a mountain climber. Now you're gonna need the two right here. Put both feet on it. Mountain climber, you need to run. Hey, Riley. Okay, feet. You're gonna need to be in a plank. Again, listen to your shoulders, and you're gonna go slow, or you can also pump it up. Ready? Go. 10, 9, abs are tight. 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 2. Good. And slowly release. That brings the heart rate up. Usually when I do high intensity, I try to do it for 30 seconds. Oof. Now what I'm going to do here. Same position, I'm just gonna cross my knees like that and cross. So you're bringing your knee towards the elbow. Are you ready? Spread your fingers, it's gonna help. You can also do fist, so engage your shoulders, abs, plank position, cross and cross. 
So feel your torso twisting. Good. 10, 9, 8, 7. Oh, I feel it. 6, 5, 4, 3, and 2. That's it. And release. Ah, that's a good workout. I'm not done. Now I'm going to pike. After the pikes, I'm going to give you a rest here for your wrists. We're going to go on our backs. For pikes, there's two ways you can do it. We can start by bringing both legs up. You can also come back with one knee up, one knee down. Okay. Are you ready? Let's go. If not, you can just do go back to a mountain climber. And up. And up. Good. Let's go again for four. Three. Two. Last one. <laughs> and release. We can do the same thing with our hands. I know. Again, you try this exercise, but don't hurt yourself. So I'm going to pike using my hands. <laughs> now I'm going to go back to plank and then pike up again. <sighs> Exhale to come. The floor is not very slippery. There we go. <sighs> it's not easy, guys. Make sure, again, you don't have any pain in your lower back. When you do this one, I'm just gonna go for two more. I much prefer doing it for my feet, my my hands. There we go. And release. Let's go on your back. That's your little rest. You're gonna use again your two towel, two towels. We're gonna do a leg curl. I have two options. You can do one leg or both legs together. So you're gonna lift your glutes, you're gonna stretch out and then come back, stretch out, come back. You're welcome to go down again if you need a rest or you stay up the entire time and do one leg at a time. Both legs, looks like that. And you need to come back quick. I don't think I'm gonna be able to do both. The floor again is too sticky. I'm just gonna stick with single. So abs are tight, shoulders down and relaxed. Let's go. Inhale to lengthen. Exhale to curl. Good. Six. Keep the hips parallel out each other. Five more. Four. Three. Hey, we have two more to go. Come on. One more time. Phew. And release. You're welcome to bring your knees right here to your chest. Oh. I'm going to turn around again. And we're going to do push-ups. I have different options again. You're welcome to stay on your all fours like that. It's easier, and you're just gonna extend one arm. I find this one very hard. I'm not very strong in my upper body. My back I am, okay? Or you can do it as well from a plank position on your knees. You go down, come up. I have tendency to lift my shoulders, so I'm just gonna do what I can. You don't need to go very low to do this one. So forward and come back. Abs are tight, forward and come back. <laughs> That's it. Oh, I'm bending my elbows. I'm cheating. <laughs> That's it. But I can go deeper though. Oh, there we go. I'm going to do only one more side. If you want to keep going, please go ahead. You're working the back of your shoulders here. Oh, done. I'm going to open my arms sideways. Same thing. You stay on your all fours. You go down, push up, 
and come back and now turn into your arms or you go down to push up open come back all the way up i'm gonna do this one i know i can do a few okay choose your options and let's go Whew. again try to keep your shoulders down you don't need to go very deep see i'm not strong in my chest i prefer <laughs> working on my back than my chest because shoulders are already rolled so i prefer working my back good oh <laughs> I'm gonna to try to do one more side. You know what? See, it's working. I'm dripping. Okay, let's go. I'm, I should say I'm perspiring. I'm glowing, I should say. There we go. Good, and release. Let's take a water break here and we'll come back right away. Welcome back. I'm gonna go back to plank. I love planks. It works so much your core, shoulders. Ah, okay, now we're gonna use everything we have even if you have four of those it's going to be even easier let's see how i'm going to do i'm going to put my feet on this one i'm going to keep my hands i'm going to do kind of a walking spider plank so we need to be on hands and feet okay and you're going to move there we go forward and you're welcome to move back as well ready go inhale Exhale, just breathe. Good, and again. Whoo, I feel that. Let's go again, one more, forward and back. Just keeping the shoulders again in the pocket. Good, and release. Whew. I'm gonna push the hand towels only with my hands. Are you ready? On your feet. Let's go. Oh, I'm struggling again here. And turn around. Let's go only forward. <laughs> Good. And again. So it's a kind of a bear crawl here. Okay. And I'm going to turn around. And that's it. Oh, that's it. Beautiful. I'm going to do the same thing with my feet. So put your feet on it. Your feet are gonna be parallel to each other. And let's go. Oh. <laughs> and move back. And forward. I hope your flow will be better than mine. <laughs> and back. Oh. There we go. So if you like this one, you have a better floor than me, please keep going. I'm gonna go back on my back. That's our heel break. I'm gonna use my hand towel and I'm gonna do a lat pull over with it. So just like that, another Pilates exercise. Abs are tight, bring your lower back in contact with the mat pelvic floor up, shoulders in contact with the mat. I'm gonna inhale, arms up, exhale. That's your option one. Keeping the lower back against the mat the entire time, suck your tummy in. Option two, you can crunch, slowly inhale, exhale. Try to separate your hands from each other. Option three, you can do a bridge, up, exhale down, Crunch, up, down, crunch. Choose your option. Let's get started. We're gonna go for eight. Ooh, I'm about to have a crumb in my hamstrings. Beautiful. So contract your glutes. Four more. Three and two. <sighs> Last one. Good. And release. You're welcome to bring your knees to your chest. 
That was your little break. I'm going to go back facing forward, down to plank. I'm going to focus only on my legs. So I'm going to do a single leg abduction. So plank, choose one leg, engage your shoulders, abs, out, and come back. Ready? Let's go. If you want to be on your forearms for a bigger base of support, a little bit easier, please go ahead. Again, six, five, four, three, two. Last one. How many feet do we have? Okay, that's the thing. We're going to switch it up. Gauge okay, shoulders, abs. Let's go out and come back. Six, five, four, three, two. I feel that. <laughs> Good. And slowly release. I'm going to go back to plank, but this time I'm going to swing my legs under. It's very similar than the mountain climber we did with the knee across. This time I'm going to try to keep my legs straight. I'm going to switch my feet. Plank. Go under. You can even go inside plank. Okay. Under. Side plank. There we go. Good. Six. Five. Four. Three, two, and you know what? We have a second side to do. Whew. Good, and release. That brings my heart rate up a little bit again. Let's get ready for the second leg. Second hand, plank, open your fingers, cross under, and optional to go inside plank. Plank. Side plank. Let's go six. Five. Whoops. <laughs> Again, four. Three. Two. Last one. Oh. And release. Beautiful. Two more exercises here. I'm gonna go on my stomach and you're gonna grab both face cloth. And I'm gonna do a cobra. So flat on my stomach, feet are gonna stay down on the mat. I need to come forward a little bit more here. I'm gonna extend my arms at the front of the mat. I'm gonna inhale. Exhale, come all the way here. Squeeze the shoulder blades together. Drop your shoulders. Press your pelvis down. Toes as well. Inhale. Exhale, come up. Inhale. Exhale. So I kept these two as a dessert. They are a little bit easier. It's a nice cool down. Working the glutes. And back biceps two more and one more good now i'm going to do circles so down circles open your arms by your hips come back and circles by your hips inhale exhale so every time we do a back extension try to lengthen your legs like the back Can we go again for four? Three. Two. One more. Nice. And release. Push yourself in child's pose.
good. And lift the chest. Voila! These were my exercises to do with hand towels or hand towel. So I hope you have enjoyed these exercises. You can do them on and on and on. If you want more videos, please go on my website, www.abstractfitness.ca. Hope to see you soon and thank you for watching.